What's up guys, we are back here with another Everything's Regular video here. We are back in the garage, man. You guys seen we have finally sold out of the Black Widow and the Street Glide. We'll be figuring out where that's going today. But before we do that, man, we got our 124 right here that started off as a 107. Also, we got our Black Widow back there that started off as a 107. Well, it still is a 107, but we did some extra stuff to it, man. And I just feel like I could help you guys out if you guys do have a 107 or, if you know, your buddies have a 114 and you got the 107. It's not the end of the world, man. You can make these things fast. You can go either route I went. Either one will put you in a nice, good number and you'll be able to feel it and it'll be real powerful, man. So if you guys haven't already, man, please like, comment, and subscribe. We're about to get into these 107s. Both bikes are 107s or rather started off as a 107. So we're about to get into them, see what's different about them and see what you can do to yours to make yours faster. You can spend the money one way or you can spend it another way, but either way, you're gonna spend the money. So I might as well show you what I did, man. So you guys can pick and choose on what you wanna do with yours, man. So if you guys haven't already, man, please like, comment, and subscribe. Let's get right into it now, shall we? And then on our 2021 Road Glide with the 107, came standard not the special or nothing man so it's just a simple 107 m8 we did our thing to it we bumped it up here so now it's a 124 we do have the fuel moto cylinders and then the fuel moto um upgraded cylinder heads they're ported and everything as well we got the push rods we got carillo pistons we got 6.3 fuel injectors we got a woods 408 m8 cam um, we also got fuel moto air breather and some other good fuel moto parts in there but um for the most part that's pretty much it with a two and a one d and a d pipe with a big bore baffle on it so that's what makes this thing sound so mean this and the the ported heads and everything and then we do have a 64 millimeter screaming eagle throttle body back there so all that in a combination is going to produce some real power when we tune it um, this one is kind of compared to my last 2020 we had with the uh, big bore upgrade. That one did, I want to say, about 145-ish to the wheel or so. Um, so this one should be right around the same numbers. I um, mean, we'll be dyno tuning this thing in a couple days or so. Just got to get some more riding time in. But all in all, this 107, well, this 124 was a 107. So now we bumped that up. And uh, I ain't gonna hold you between this and Black Widow. Now on Black Widow, I just did a cam on there. Um, it already had pipes and stuff. So I did a cam on there and I spent about the same price that I spent here in parts rather as I got the whole cam set up there. So I'll give you guys more detail on the Black Widow, but we'll just uh, pull this one out and then line them up together and see then we have here our 2017 road glide special black widow looking all good with the black and red mix now this one is a 2017 special however it still is a 107 straight from factory so the specials on the 2017s that came with the 107 um, but this one here it already came with the with the screaming eagle breather um and then they already had the two into one SNS side winder pipe. So it sounded pretty good. It just wasn't as fast. Now, what we did, all we did was put a Screaming Eagle cam in there, some new push rods and stuff. And that was pretty much it. Now, the Screaming Eagle cam I got, I kind of forgot which one it is, but pretty sure they're all about the same, if not around the same for the 107. So Screaming Eagle cam for the 107 M8, um, it did about... I want to say 117, like 108, 117 torque. Um, really not that high in horsepower, but the torque gains on this thing was really crazy. So it actually just like literally pulls like right now, untuned bike to bike. I think this bike can take that 124 because that one, like I said, is untuned right now because we're still trying to break it in. But 107 to 107. I think this one will take it just because it's gonna do the dash. No question about it, no problems, no nothing. It's just gonna go. But I ain't gonna hold you, man. I spent, I wanna say about a good $3,000 on installing this cam and buying it and everything, or a good 35 rather. One of the two, I forget, it was close around there. So just take that 3,000 opposed to, you know, a good like 4,000 without the pipe with the pipe it was about five thousand just with parts 
um, probably a little bit more than that. But do that plus labor. Now you're at about a good 10 grand opposed to three grand. And I'm not going to hold you. Um, if this thing had a chain, it will pre it will pretty much like change the game. So if you had a chain on this bike, you probably would uh, get the same effect you would out of this one. Now, I ain't going to hold you after spending nearly like five to six thousand dollars on just parts alone on this bike. Um, if you would have spent like maybe an extra thousand more here rather than, you know, just thirty five hundred and got like a chain drive on this bike oh my god you'll feel that power and everything a lot more um because then it'll be popping willies but that's pretty much the same effect you get on this bike without a chain how that bike is fast with a chain and how it reacts with a chain this bike reacts without a chain so just imagine with a chain on this bike is going to go freaking crazy can't wait to see what this thing is going to come out like um when it's all tuned and said and done so the choice is yours, man. If you got a 107, you want to make it fast, man. My personal opinion, I feel like you should get you some nice pipes, a nice air breather, and then go with the cam and a chain drive. Your very first, your very first shot, man. So do that unless, <clears throat> unless you want to spend the extra thousand or so and just wait a few weeks, get the whole big board kit. The big board kit itself is not that uh not that expensive compared to the whole cam job so just uh do your price search and figure out which kit you want to go with but i would definitely do the 124 kit um if you can but if you can't you can still get that effect out of a 107 just do the cam the pipe do a chain and this thing will freaking go crazy if you really want to do some extra stuff do the throttle body the heads and stuff just go crazy with it man so the choice is yours Y'all let me know what y'all think about it in the comments below. What's y'all favorite bike, man? Y'all know which one is faster. But uh, we got to get these things cleaned up and stuff for the winter today. Because um, we're about to be giving away Black Widow today, man. So we're about to get them cleaned up. Meanwhile, I am about six to like 700 miles in on the break-in on this daddy -o, So can't wait. A couple more days and we'll be dyno tuning this joint. All righty, man. You know what time it is. Last wash before we get that CVO and that road glide out of here just got to make his make them look as best as we can for the new owners it's time to go up also got to get bay ready because you guys already know this thing is about to be heading to one of you guys if you guys haven't entered the giveaway I'm giving away my 124 and my Ford Raptor first place man so go over to everythingsregular.com right now go get you an entry can't wait it's time to get these things iced down and cleaned up, man. And just like that, man, about an hour later, we finally got them all cleaned up, wiped down. CVO is looking good. Got to get those uh, mirrors on there real quick. But other than that, it is shined up nice, man. This thing got the extra speakers on it, man. Whoever about to win this today is about to win a freaking deal, man. This thing sounds amazing. We got Black Widow right here all shined up. You can even see the white buttons on this joint today, man. That's freaking dope looking real sick now i ain't gonna hold you this wasn't my favorite bike at first but like speed wise and the way it looks and just torque and everything it's definitely one of them ones man definitely a nice ride i love black widow and i'm sure somebody whoever is going to win it today is going to love it even more man i can't wait to see where these things is going these two are finally out of here they are finally going it's finally one of y'all bikes but you guys see bay man on them gold daddy -os. Looking all good, man. I can't wait. I love when this thing is clean. It shines up really nice. The dust just hides that color like that blue. But other than that, man, got her back shined up. Looking all excellent. We're about to put these things back in the garage, man. And probably go on a ride on uh, our Blue Thunder here and uh, get ready for our giveaway today. But 
so far so good so far so good man let me know what you guys think about them in the comments below i am digging them and i hope you are too and just because this is pretty much the last time we're gonna have them all lined up this is the last time i'm washing these two so it's the freaking last time for everything so we'll see what's up there we go now it's sparking today it's sparking up today man Blackwood, oh man, I just love when this thing is shined up. She looks so good. I ain't gonna hold you, dog. I ain't gonna hold you. We might have to do something else like Black Widow. I ain't gonna hold you. But she settled today. She real settled. finale on them joints baby looking good looking good looking good this one is about to be one of y'all's this time around so i'll let you guys get a sneak peek of what y'all about to be hearing every morning and stuff, man. little sneak peek of what y'all about to be hearing <laughs> Like this 124 dog it ain't nothing like this 124 this one sounds so much more beastier than black widow so this is just the real difference y'all get between doing the cylinders the cylinder heads and uh the throttle body and the whole big board kit it just sounds a lot more beefier on the rip than on the startup that's for sure so we're gonna pull this thing in here and get it going real quick. Man, these things look real good lined up next together. I ain't gonna hold you. That gold definitely hit a lot more in the freaking, uh, in the garage black widow here cvo already get ready for the giveaway can't wait if you guys haven't entered for my 2021 road glide man head over to everythingsregular.com right now buy you a blue hat and you'll be entered in to win my 2021 road glide with the 124 on it paired together for first place with my 2017 ford raptor and if you guys don't win first place man we got second place our 2017 road glide that's about to be done we got our 23 that should be here in a, in a couple days for the front wheel along with the windshield and we're going to complete that one off you guys don't win first place or second place man we got third place and i know you guys see my pops 2013 road glide with all the bells and whistles man we're giving them all the way first second and third place man so head on over to everythingsregular.com if you haven't entered the giveaway man and then it is the next morning guys and we finally know where these bikes are going man our 2017 road glide first place winner is heading to mark Slaymaker of delaware man we are heading all the way over to the east coast i can't wait to get over there it's gonna be cold as heck and our 2015 street glide cbo is headed up to northern california to our dog royce bradley of northern california man i can't wait to get these bikes shipped out to you and be at your dough sooner than you know man so i can't wait if you guys haven't already man please like comment and subscribe man if you guys missed out on black widow and the cvo man it's never the end of the road man we got our 2021 road glide with the gold 124 up for grabs paired along with our ford raptor yes our 2017 ford raptor for first place so i'm giving the truck 
and the bike away, man. The bike will be on back of the truck, man. So that means you got to fly in and take delivery of the truck with the bike on the back, man. So head on over to everythingsregular.com right now. Go get you a hat. We even got a second place bike, man. We got our 2017 Road Glide right here with the candy apple red. It'll have a 23 inch wheel on there. I can't wait for that. Then we got a third place Road Glide, man. So if you guys haven't already, man, head on over to everythingsregular.com while you can. Go get you a new blue hat. The big one, man. Enter while you can. And meanwhile, it's time for your boy to go put some more miles on this one. 124 so we can finally tune him man i'm trying to see these numbers and i'm trying to pull up on some of these harley people man to see what the, what's what's really the word man you know i'm trying to see what this thing really do man so i can't wait if you guys haven't already man please like comment and subscribe man enter to win i will catch you guys on the next one dog appreciate you dog peace